Welcome to another DWA Off The Cuff. Um, it is Friday, some day of the month. I think it's the thir 30th or 29th of, um, of uh, March, yeah, that's it. Uh, I'm driving to work, and this weekend is Easter weekend. Um, we had Radwood last week. It went killer. Couldn't have uh, couldn't have been better, really, for uh, for the situation. Uh, weather held off. It was beautiful, and uh, yeah, we don't have any events on the calendar for a little bit of time. The next Radwood is going to be June 24th. That's a Sunday, and that's going to be at Oyster Point, which is uh, just, uh, it's in South San Francisco, um, near where Radwood 1 was, so like right down the road from where Radwood, Radwood 1 was. And uh, this one should be kind of one of our uh, big shows, kind of LA style. Um, looking to have some some more stuff like extracurricular stuff like um, we'll have probably have the video game tent again maybe a little better bigger and better than lot than a hoopty con we also want to um, I don't know maybe bring in a little uh, dance party or something maybe uh, some BMXers skateboarders uh, some other stuff like that and Hope, hoping to have the food like super dialed at this one where we have um, some really good food trucks like not just you know not just your standard fries and burgers but some cool um, hipster food places uh, you know just keep people more entertained and stuff like that and it's gonna be there's a nice grass there's a nice grassy area overlooking the water so it'll be really comfortable to be at um, weather's like, I mean, cross your fingers will be awesome since it's going to be at the end of June in the Bay Area, um, which is pretty, pretty great weather usually. Um, and yeah, so that's the next Bradway at HoopDecon. And then what else do we have planned? Uh, Art and I are heading down to LA next week for uh, Race Services Open House launch. If you don't know race services, they uh, spawn from Donut Media, so they're kind of like the same, but race services, I guess they're doing like builds and more kind of like representing um, drivers and stuff like that, as opposed to Donut Media, which has turned into a total media company. Uh, and then, what else? oh, we're going to be on uh, Smoking Tire, Art and I will. Um, we're recording that next week as well so that should be out in a couple weeks uh i know he's you know matt's doing two episodes of that of that podcast a week now so um that's why lowly people like us are invited on um and then next month is lufkeholt in uh, torrance california so art warren brian and i no actually art warren and i will all be down there brian can't make it unfortunately um, and we're planning a little uh, Coastal Ranch Rally 2018 the movie premiere the night before uh, in around the Torrance area. So we'll be putting up an Eventbrite page for that uh, soon. So be on the lookout. Follow us on Instagram at Driving Wall Awesome. That's the best place to follow us, really. Uh, we're also on Facebook, but that's just like everything from Instagram just gets pushed to Facebook. Um, I'm trying to think what else is going on in our lives. We're just really busy. Um, we are... Oh, yeah, we started a Patreon page for kind of su supporting the podcast more than anything else. So it's just a place for people to, you know, donate a little... Uh, a little dough to our cause and um, keep our ship alive, keep our ship afloat. Uh, we have some special things we're giving out there, like special stickers um, for Patre Patreon only stickers and uh, early signups for stuff like the movie premiere that's going to be next month. 
So we'll put it on our uh, Patreon first, maybe a day or two in advance. And then, so those people will get like, you know, first, the, you know, first choice. And then, uh, because that event's like almost guaranteed to sell out too. And when I say sell out, I think we're doing it free for, it's going to be free, but, uh, yeah, so we're going to be doing a bunch of stuff there. We also have like Patreon only posts, uh, polls, stuff like that. And we'll be doing giveaways too. So we're going to be doing, uh, some trivia, Patreon only trivia and giveaway prizes and send, send stuff to people. Uh, we also just posted the Coastal Range Rally, the movie that we made from the Coastal Range Rally on Patreon page for Patreon subscribers. So if you're a Patreon subscriber, you get a little, little few little extras and maybe we'll do a few bonus episodes of the podcast here and there. It's just kind of all up in the air right now, but we wanted to get it, get that thing going. And, uh, yeah, it's been good. We have a bunch of people already signed up and we're super stoked on it. Um, but you know, the truth is we do the podcast. We'll probably end up doing the podcast forever, regardless of whether or not we made money or not. So, um, and I think most of our listeners know that, that we're just super passionate about it. And it's a, it's a, you know, it's a day a week that we get to get together, um, from our normal lives and we get to talk about cars and just kind of hang out, uh, gives us an excuse to hang out every week where, uh, you know, when you're younger, you're going to bars every day and so every night and stuff like that. But now we all have families and stuff. So, uh, yeah, it's a, it's a nice, nice thing to have in our lives as a podcast. And then everything else that's surrounded it has been really fun for us. Um, setting, you know, having these rallies, the coastal range rallies and then, uh, Radwood and all the stuff, all the friendships that have spawned from it all just been such an awesome experience. So, um, yeah, I guess that's all I wanted to say. Just a bunch of updates. Uh, the GTI just clocked, it just turned uh, over 39,000 miles about 30 minutes ago. So I'm at 39,031 miles on this car. I bought it in January of uh, 2017. So you do the math. Had it about a year and two months or something, a uh, year and three months, and yeah, that's all I wanted to say, so uh, we will see you guys soon, hopefully, if I don't see you before next week, Art and I will do some stuff when we're out in LA, and uh, that's a wrap, later.